The new bus, donated by the Embassy of China, will assist the students and young adults at the Lady Ho Choi home who are unable to navigate the public transport system. President of the Lady Ho Choi Centers of Trinidad and Tobago, Howard Sabga, said the home operates from five locations across the country and services residents with special needs. This vehicle would be used to transport our residents and school children to their various activities. Vehicles at the Lady Ho Choi homes are also used to transport children to the Lady Ho Choi Special Schools and their Lady Ho Choi Vocational Center to and from school along the east-west corridor. Minister of Social Development and Family Services Donna Cox acknowledged that access is a key factor to assist persons with disabilities to be included in society. Access to reliable transportation is of utmost importance for persons with disabilities. So this school bus, I understand, does not only provide an opportunity for children and staff to commute back and forth, but it connects them to programs, to institutions, to services, and to communities. Chinese ambassador to TNT, Fang Chu, said the donation was a vivid testament of brotherhood and friendship between Trinidad and Tobago and China. Just as President Xi Jinping said, Satisfying the people's aspiration for a better life is the goal of all our work. With this goal in mind, I have regarded the betterment of our two peoples as one of my top priorities since I came to this country. Ambassador Fang added that by working together, both countries can achieve greater development and develop their friendship. Kimberly D'Souza, TTT News.